Primus, those damn blue collared tweakers, guitar tabs, and guitar lesson. Okay, so this would just be a standard tuning here, EAD, GBE, and uh, definitely want to be using some uh, wah pedal effect here, um, especially for like this intro part. Uh, we're basically just doing two positions just back and forth with the wah pedal. We'll start with it down, so like the treble side. And he may very well be using some type of like harmonizer or some different effect here, but uh, just by trying to like grab what I can by ear and knowing that he's like up in this area, uh, we'll try something like this, which I think sounds pretty dang close. Uh, we'll start with 13 on the E, skip the A, so you can just keep it dead, and then 12D and a 13G. Alright, those are pretty much the notes I was able to hear in that chord. And uh, like I said, we want the wah pedal down for that. And then basically we hit a 13G and 13B, and when we hit that, we just tilt the wah pedal up for the, the bass side of it. For the main riff here, uh, we'll start with the open A power chord to a B, so the open A and 2D to the 2A, 4D. Alright, now we just jump up a set of strings, so now we're at the 2E, 4A for that F sharp. Off to the open E power chord, back to the F sharp, the 2 and 4, open E, and then give a couple hits on the F sharp here at the 2 and 4. So we went. Alright, and basically we do that whole thing twice. Alright, and then we come down and we'll kind of stay in the open to two on the A. Stay in that area for this next section where we just do open A to the B power chord, open A, couple B power chords, open A to the B power chord. So it's. And then basically we just finished by doing the, repeating the section we did at the start there. All right, we cruise through that a few times and then we just kind of hit a two on the E for that F sharp note and just hit it, let it ring, give it some vibrato. And I think after the second time we do like the main riff, we get this little lead part here, fun thing, where we're, we'll slide up to 11 on the G. Okay, just for that high F sharp note. And then we'll do this quick little 9 on the A, back to the 11 G. And then we do 10 D, pull it off to 9, back to 10. Hit the 11 G bend it, release it, back to the 10D, hit the 9A, slide it down, hit the 2E. All right, for this solo section here, uh, first half of it, or first, you know, three quarters of it, pretty, pretty uh, locked in here. Uh, the, the last little bit there, it gets super shreddy and gets, you know, it's, he uses such funky scales, it's like, okay, I'll give a best interpretation there. But uh, for this initial part, where the G and the B string slide up to 16G, hit the 17B, just kind of hang out there, pick between them, give them a little vibrato. Okay, then just slide it up two frets, so we're, we're then going between the 18 and 19. All right, and we would basically go through it again, but we can kick on the wah. All right, and then just kind of give it some some fun like wah back and forth while we're doing it. And then we can also include this 20 on the high E and just kind of upward go between the 20, 19, and 18 here. Alright, and continuing with the solo there, uh, 
we get to this 16 on the G, give it a bend, hit the 17 on the high E, release the 16 G. Do this little descending uh, scale here on the G where we go 14, 16, 14, 13, 14, 13, 11, 13. Back off to the 11. And here's where it starts getting like super shreddy. Uh, I would just kind of stay in that similar scale that we were doing there. Maybe do something like the G go 11, 13, 14, down to the B 11, 13, 14, zoom it up, do like a backwards 17, 16, 14 there. And then you can keep it moving with like the same thing on the G 17, 16, 14. So we'd like, and then you can just bring it all the way back up again, go, uh, you know, 14, 16, 17, 14, 16, 17, B. Maybe hit that 17 on the high E. And then just kind of do like uh, the uh, 15, 16 on the uh, G and B there. And then just slide it up. I run out of frets, so just get as many frets as you can in there, slide it up. And then we would just slide it all out and then hit a big F sharp power chord. Mm -hmm. 